Hey everyone, it's Amateur, and I'm super excited. <laughs> I'm super excited to share with you guys what I have today. Today is a small business Saturday or shop small Saturday, however it is that you want to say it. And I wanted to put something in my shop that I've been thinking about and trying to work on and boo-booed it several times for the shop. So this is going to be a limited run of these items that this set, I have two sets of ornaments for Christmas. This is going to be a pre-order and this is going to be a pre-order and they will only be available until, if I'm not mistaken, I said the 28th or the 29th of November and they will ship out the 3rd of December. So I'm trying to get them done. I didn't want to make a lot and then maybe they not sell. So that's why I'm doing a pre-order. So please be considerate of that. They will ship out the 3rd and the 3rd of December. So you will get them in time for Christmas for you to be able to decorate. And I'm super excited. You could also use it for this year. I'm super talking fast. Sorry, I'm excited. Uh, they will be available for a limited time. And I, and only this time am I going to make them. I might make something in the future or whatnot. But I'm super excited. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Let me show you. First, um, like I said, they will be on um, pre-order until the 28th or the 29th. I have to just check the blog. I will leave a link to my blog right here where you're able to find that at amateurcraftkit.com to put in your order. I do have a limited amount that I will make. If they do sell out, which I'm hoping, hoping you guys, please buy them. <laughs> if they do sell out, I'll consider putting, putting more in the shop. It just depends on how long it's going to take me to make these. So without further ado, let me show you. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm super excited. I forgot. I don't even know which way I'm looking. Okay, so you guys may know that I am Ray Dunn obsessed, okay? Just a little bit, but I can quit anytime I want. So I wanted to make ornaments. Now, um, I have made ornaments already and where did they go of course you guys why would i be 100 percent ready for a video right anyway i swear you come for the comic relief at least so you guys made uh no i made these as gifts now the reason that i didn't make these to sell many people did ask because there are so 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 many available on mercari there's so many available on ebay and on etsy and Everybody has to have a little side hustle. You know, everybody has to have a little bit of money for some crafts. Craft supplies are not cheap. So what I decided to do was I going, I was going to make a Ray Dunn inspired ornament, but I needed something different, something that wasn't already out there. So let me show you what I made. I have two different sets available and I have the white mug. Now, this is a lightweight. These are lightweight um, clay. I made several attempts here. I will show you. I orig originally started with regular clay, and this is what happened. They were super brittle and didn't work out. I still have these because I might use them for myself. Um, but I, it's not a product that I want to put in my shop that would be strong enough to survive shipping and whatnot. So these are three and a quarter inch tall. They fit right here in my hand. Now they will come with either twine or ribbon. I haven't decided. I'm thinking of maybe using twine so it doesn't take away from the actual mug. But they have been painted and they have been vinyled and everything to give it that ceramic look. They're about... What is the... Um, Three-eighths of an inch thick, if I'm not mistaken. And they're... Look, they're pretty solid, but it is lightweight clay. Um, it is some of my favorite clay that I like using, so that is what I used. This one has it says cocoa, nice. <laughs> this is this jingle. I, you guys, I'm so excited. This one is the falalala, well falala, yes, and the Mary. Now, this was my original thought. This was my original set, so these set will be available on my shop. For a limited time, like I said, for you to pre-order. Um, super excited. But look, and they're and they're very light. It's a very light clay because let's be honest, the rate on ornaments are like 10 pounds a piece and they make your tree hang. Now, I started with this and then I was like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, why am I not doing a red set? Yes, I am. Why do I sound like I'm on one of those cheesy midnight uh, shopping shows? All right, you guys, not only will you get this, you will get this and oh my gosh, for a limited time. Anyway, by the way, I finished all my coffee. It's kicked in. It's, yeah, it's that time. Now, the second set is, this is the first set. I will only have a few of those. I mean, 
those available. Here's the funny thing. I boo-booed some of them and I broke them. But here is part of the red set. Now, um, the red set will also have five as stuff is just um, going everywhere. The red set will also have five ornaments. I am missing my Believe and Santa. But look at this. And look, it has a nice sheen because I sprayed so much paint on this. It's not even funny because I wanted it to have that smooth, um, that smooth ceramic look to it. So there's a Mrs. Claus. Like I said, I'm missing the Santa and Believe. Santa's Helper. This one is Santa's Helper. Look at that. Oh my gosh. And this one says a Merry Christmas. You guys, I'm crazily obsessed. I was actually only going to do four, like a set of four. But I'm like, no, I like I couldn't decide. It took me longer to decide which phrases to use than it did to probably make these. So I'm super, super, super excited, you guys. But like I said, this set and it's like lightweight clay lightweight clay. And um these will have, it's also Merry Christmas, Santa's Helper, Mrs. Claus, Believe, and Santa. And they're each going to be the same price. I'm just going to have a limited amount of um, pre-orders available. So it gives me time. It's going to give me about a week to make them. If I don't sell that many and um, I get them done sooner, they'll ship out sooner. But the latest, they will ship out on Monday the 3rd. That's Monday the 3rd. So hopefully that'll be right before the crazy Christmas shipping and everything and you should get them right away. It will be regular, uh, regular postal shipping because these aren't super breakable. Um, and shipping will only be like three something or whatever. It's a small rate package because they're not super heavy. So they should be there pretty quick. It'll be first class shipping, but you guys, I am, Oh my gosh, I am just beyond the moon that these finally worked out. Sadly, my first, second, and I think third round did not come out, but these finally came out to what I wanted, how I wanted them. And like I said, they will each have a twine. Let me ask you, what do you guys think? Let's see, I have my twines over here. Let me go around them to test this puppy out. All right. I know some people like the modern farmhouse, some people like the more of the rustic farmhouse. So, I can either do, because I haven't decided, because I want them both, or ribbon. I just didn't want to use ribbon to have it take away, oh, I think that one would be perfect, to have it take away from um, from the actual mug. Do, do, do. Right, let's sample one off here. Now, these will be simply tied like this in case you don't... Actually, I'm thinking of just adding the twine and not tying it because some people prefer bows. Some people prefer just a knot. And that is how it does hang. Some people prefer a knot. Some people might want to tie it off here so it hangs specifically from here. So I might just add the twine. This one, I don't know. I feel like this one takes away from it a little bit. It's thicker. But it's, um, it's more fray, <laughs> that's a, if that's a word. So, and someone suggested that I sign at least the, the back of one of the sets. So I probably will just sign a little love Amador or something on the back of them. Just to say a little thank you to you guys uh, while I send these off to their new homes. But I think I'm going to do this original red and white twine because it will not, let's see. I feel like it lets the... But I might, oops, might do a double. I feel like it lets the ornament shine, you know? But I might just include it on the side so you can hang it how you choose. Let me see. Doo -doo -doo. Like literally, we're trying to figure this out as we go. And... Let's see here, okay. So yeah, so then this will hang like that. Super, super cute, I'm absolutely in love. I think I will be using the um, this Baker's Twine. This is actually original Baker's Twine because it lends, the colors are perfect and it, um, it doesn't take away from the actual ornament. So I totally like that. I don't like it when the ribbon is like 
this and that's what you see about the ornament so anyway i'm so excited you guys so hopefully you guys sorry for all the bubbling i mean the babbling oh my goodness <laughs> all the babble, bu babbling and all the excitedness i really appreciate it i've been wanting to make something like this in such a long time um and i finally came, i finally got it to work correctly so like i said these are available now in my shop i will as soon as this video loads everything will go live in the shop for the white and the red ornament set and they are ready to go oh my gosh and i know it takes a little bit out of my profit but if you do buy them together it'll only charge you one shipping good deal no so yeah so thank you guys for supporting small business saturdays i really appreciate it i hope you guys go and buy these i'll get to happy work to them and um yes i will throw some pictures in here so you guys will see i am super excited thank you guys for stopping by and go check out my shop bye everyone